Patrick here from the Garage Band Guide and in this video I'm going to show you how easy it is to upload your latest Garage Band masterpiece to the place where you, the Garage Band Guide community, have chosen as your favourite place to host your audio online. And that place is SoundCloud. I should mention that this video is part of a larger feature on SoundCloud. That's over at thegaragebandguide.com. So once you're finished watching the video, get your ass over there and check it out. The link is down there in the description box. Okay, so we'll export from GarageBand iOS first of all. To do that, on the track select screen, just hold down on the project that you want to upload to SoundCloud and you'll see all the icons do that crazy little dance that they do when you're going to edit stuff. From here, just hit the share icon in the top corner and you'll see you'll be able to select SoundCloud from the list that you're given. Once you select it, you'll be prompted to enter all your login details and stuff. So I'll go ahead and enter mine here just now. Now you can change the name of your track here if you want. You can also change whether it will be shared publicly or kept private from here. Uh, you can choose whether you want to allow people to download it as well and also you can select the quality of the upload. You might as well just pick the highest quality one here. There's not really any point in, in picking a lower one really. Once you're done, just tap share and wait for it to export. Okay, done. It's just as simple if you're uploading from your Mac too. So on soundcloud.com, click the upload button at the top here and when prompted, select choose file uh, and upload. I should point out that you will need to have exported a track from GarageBand previously before going through this. Once you've selected your track, you'll get the opportunity to rename it again. Uh, you can add tags, which is quite handy to help people find your music. Uh, you can also add a picture here. So if you've got some rocking album art lying around, you can add it here and help give your track a bit of character. Again, choose whether your track will be public or private once it's uploaded and you can share directly to whichever social media sites you're into from here as well. And there's a few other advanced options you can dive into here too. Save when you're done and just do the whole wait for it to finish uploading thing. Once it's done, you'll be able to head to your song's very own page and check out its sexy waveform and have a little listen to it as well. So I'll just quickly show you how your track will look when shared to different social media sites. In this case, I'll show you how it looks on Facebook. So just copy the URL of your track and paste it into the status box here. Hit post and you can see not only is your artwork for your track shown in the post, but once you click on it to play, the actual waveform of your track is shown as it plays too, which is pretty cool. If you like this video, then show it some love. Hit the like button, it really does help. And you might as well subscribe while you're there. Remember and come and check out that full feature on SoundCloud at thegaragebandguide.com. The link is in the description. Bye for now.